Okay, it's time for me to MLP vlog, and hopefully I'm not too out of the time, and I actually have something. Okay, today we have Every Little Thing She Does, written by Michael Vogel. Go, go reply here that thought I've been doing, um, thought I've been doing pretty dang well, on or magical, I can, you know, doing a crazy spells, but she's fallen behind a little bit on the friendship like in the end, while trying to find her way at a thing. Um... You know, uh, they have Starlight catch up on a few, like, and again, Starlight has a few things she has to do with <coughs> to be made. Okay, can't you freaking way to speed it up, she will, you know, hit the time, she, she, big thing she's gonna do, she's gonna do, combine all the many little lessons with both people, with both ponies, to do them roughly at once, because she can get it done a lot quicker, and when that kind of fails, she, Dog and follow the hypnotize them into basically doing, you know, forbidding go vague and get done that done even quicker and clarity and things. I thought it was not up that well, but, you know, go, <laughs> like, like, well, we're going to have to start going or the cops going to be the bike of either way, but with the execution, I already have been. I've seen, well, see one person be flat mixed with everyone else and be like, hey, I'm to get her dang. Um, Go, I do know. That's going to. Anyway, go, I do know that the big thing that would kind of divide people in Bim Starlink morality. You would think at this point you know it's not a good, it's not a good idea to hypnotize your friends. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Go on being go deeper. Do come fresh trip like a layer that they do coming quite creepy. Hmm. Like, kind of like in the room, because they're gonna... Like in Gear 2, Starlight Boogaloo. Yeah, but, um... Um... Yeah, yeah but, um... If they want me that one, I've been compared. Um... And the, um... I think some people think it's not... Some people think it's not too believable, but at this point, she would still think it's a good idea. I think some people are probably okay, because she is learning, like, this quarter while well, again, it's still in the... But considering, you know, we haven't seen far for it, it is a, a debatable aspect. I don't know if it's un... Some people look enough... For me, in general, it's kind of pretty entertaining, and that element, a lot of stuff found interesting, and she learned a lesson in a way that seems genuine. And you can almost kind of be too good, because Starlight is... Still getting used to the thing, and she is a lot more used to magic calling her. I'm feeling, you know, she is used to magic merely. I mean, she's done a lot of magic going tough, and me and them because the friendship thing is like, go and make sure she wants to call Bingo magic, and they might bring up the freaky thing. Um, yeah, she has got too much better friendship. Can she actually push her against that episode? Yeah. And she had a Regan that she had been doing them. She'd been avoiding one on purpose because she's nervous and whatever. And you know, that that bit there, that revelation gives everything else more Regan. Oh, okay. Now we get that she is get that pretty young friendship go. She would want to get you know, get through it quicker. You know? Yeah, and um there first of all, far uh, far joke go fight new was showing the one they're going Good joke here, uh, between him and Thorne especially. They, they rehash for no time for, it's not the fight, but like a joke where they rehash for no time for a song a bit. <laughs> yeah, cause, yeah, cause, but I thought it was kind of better, it was funny ever because they just went all out, really seemingly making a think. But it looked kind of more plot really, I don't want to schedule no time for a song. And, they're about to make King of Pink Lion, Pink Lion gonna King Kong about it. And the first line is calling about it got Pink and Kate to make a pretty. It might be a certain song, you know. I don't know if we got the wording from that of the song, but it's definitely gonna come more with Pinkie Pie. Yeah. But, um. Yeah, we're gonna be coming out of that, yeah, I think. And Pike just got some good. But, you know, some good lines and jokes in general. And the entertainment value comes from the crazy things that happen, which he hit the him eventually. Big stupid thing, which, I mean, when she done that, that, when she got caught in the line, and, you know, she probably threw down more punishment for that, although, <laughs> making her feel punishment, go, I love the bit where, where, where everyone should go, because of what happened, everyone's going, that rarity actually, 
you know, everyone keep it down. Before I try to start talking, it's got your flashlight. Don't be so loud. <laughs> Find a good flashlight now. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> but that's a kick on in Berber or what? I don't know what any of that was. Um, but yeah. Um, and of course, what the way you gotta do, boom. Um, I do believe for the flag girl doing what she did to bite. Be a Viking for some people. I think that would be what maybe a couple people might think. Oh, do what I might a couple of you people go fine. <laughs> people go not giggle, not go with a pony, and it go weird. And Starlight is like, I again I did say the problem that they repeated implicitly when they did with um with a Shimmer and I believe it was the first time because the first time that kind of thing happened in here like yeah. And again, I don't know how they quite from the get the turn around that you know she had, but you know, who knows by me I'm thinking Wilkie. Um <clears throat> in general cock would have been saying when again first I won't go on the talk of like because okay, give me five cool to have her do that, but like really I understand certain thing, but file, you know, him tying them and make him do what she gotta get like that. Pretty, um, I go by my foot, you want to hang out. I mean, a hell of a team, kind of, they get, you may not want or be equal. Again, I, you know, like, that little remnant of her. And, and again, um, you know, but I do think, again, the, the ending in which they reveal why she would put her love and kind of give her character more weight and explain, okay, she now up get you to, like, she, will make mistakes, can be more focused on magic and efficiency than anything else, and, um, I feel like that, I keep on getting to go, saying, uh, you know, just, you know, whatever. Yeah, um, you know, and that can kind of me, you get, <clears throat> you know, the total story, you know, I'm doing a tape value, because I've got a lot of fun with how things get cranky out of control, and they can get to a pool now, and, you know, and everyone... Ugh, yeah, yeah. Ugh, it's not that out of it, so... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, the big thing I want to talk about was that big element. I don't think all people might be able to do it in some way, or find it entertaining, but, like, okay, plan is going to typically doing that thing. Oh, yeah, that's going to... Kill and come from some people consider it to be not a great and feel if you if you get then you find a pretty interesting up go back. You know, again it the human act next moment for Starlight if we get, you know, a bit more of a a glimpse into how she you know, feels about Lovic and why the kind of weird and friendship thing, you know. Yeah. It's, it's interesting. I believe the development is definitely one important thing in the cup and you know. Um I want to sure the, I'll be the more of the book about the ship. Um, Diana got clung up at one point. Horrifying. Um, yeah, like a couple coins fell. No need for a mirror pool this time. <laughs> um, <coughs> so, yeah, uh, I'm pretty good at going again. I believe the, again, the, it could pretty entertaining up going and it come out of the I don't like in the end it does lead to like leaking ending. But at the same time, yeah, what she does and coming and not maybe her believable, but at the same time there are things that could could make it more believable and work in context. You know? Um so and if you're it depends what kind of person you are, if you focus on if you're a little more picky but you might have a little bit of feeling about the you did. Or if you're not picky, or you're well, you're fine. Again, it depends how you're gonna do this. If you, what the episode, the way to the episode go over, and if you believe it won't believe all that she did that, then it will work and be pretty entertaining. If you don't believe it, then it'll be a mixed bag. Okay, will we? So, but in general, I will rate the one good because I do believe that there was a weakening in what she did that kind of like against their gushing development, and it's a pretty entertaining episode. So. so not far, actually, how vocal, Michael Vogel done so far. Hmm. Heartwarming tale, fuck up your life, and fiction, and 
Okay then. Um, yeah, it's hard to die up because he ain't beating hard for me, tail. If I got from the general, eh, if I got like roughly two to the full vote, I think the story would, you know, you know, get straight a little more, but. Well, with my character life, really, Trip Fifth took a different story, though. Again, I think what he did there was kind of interesting, and, you know, definitely entertaining, and, uh, you know, get straight how they were to left him there, in a proper way. Um, <laughs> mm, but, there you go. I didn't get for the cup of color that call I got, okay, go. Yeah, um, maybe a big quibble at one point, but I believe they do make up for it, and they clearly can entertain you, you know, it gives that great a go. Yeah. I like it, you know, again, I think people premiere like this one, but there'll be a problem where people take bigger issue with, sorry, guys, man, I'm totally going to be back to the general, because the cup code is not going to help at all, okay, pranking with everyone that's going to like a side, um, and sorry, tricking, yeah, yeah, um, <laughs> but, um, there, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, so, um, I feel like more of that one, or Red League, I will add more entertaining, um, that one's fine. It's just that uh, I don't remember that much about what side of the you know, you might have been. Go. Go, there you go. <clears throat> I got a little. Uh, <coughs> I think I got something. I don't know. <laughs> That's not go weird when I'm not talking. Um, Kabog, every little thing she does. No idea why I called that. Kind of a weird title. I don't know what that relates to. What's going on? <laughs> On Wikipedia, on, especially on their Kingdom page, uh, instead of a normal comedy, you just get a TBA eventually for the code. Not sure why. <laughs> Be, uh, they even have for an next few episodes for Humble Comedy. But, oh well. No, so, if you're done, we're gonna put in the got a problem. Yeah, that could be Google Chrome, but not much wrong. Go, go, act, go, yeah, I'm here for the beat up code. Next week, in front of the upper code, we have PPOV Pony Point of View. That one kind of like a lot of fun, even though we kind of, yeah, that kind of like could be a thing up code. But also on Saturday, October 1st, next week, we have the relink of My Little Pony Country Girl Legend of the Everfree, which will be available on Netflix. So that means going for quick, people can spread it to everywhere else too. Go, I think people get a hold of it. Really, not on the Curry family in October, I don't think. At least not on that day. Which means I well, which means I don't have a particular time I have to watch it. But yeah, I'll be doing a vlog on that as well. Like a fresh of gang of long that called um not how to sure when the you know every free vlog go up. Again, it really depends on the timing I have. Yeah, I don't wanna wait too long. I mean I could wait until after I do, you know, my um marathon other stuff, but, um, we'll have to see, we'll find out, but we'll have that in the regular could be long. Again, King Tyrell of, of Pretty Group Week, I've got the King Day, I've got an episode. Not sure why. Um, anyway, um, Pink Crush Girl on today, we have the track of the log on the first movie. Should be fun to talk about. Uh, Alright, in that video, I only had, only had DVD out, just so I could show it to you, but I have it to there, but I don't think I want to have to watch it. Um, you know, yeah, um, and then, not, in October, I'm going to do a Mick Viagra 2 on Halloween, up to like, I don't even know, for any of that works, I don't know, but, um, but again, we'll see how that goes, but in terms of maybe I'll, that's why I just get it, what I'm doing. Uh, <sighs> oh, you know, that's me, fine. But I have a few, I should have VF3 and on Tuesday, a Quetria Girl, one, two, one, two. Well, now I'm starting to come more out of it. Again, I, uh, I don't know. I don't know what happened when I'm, why I get go out of it when I'm doing the even though I might feel different. Again, talking, just a good thing, a different thing. I go, you know, I'm going to end it now. Go. Bye.